The last chain. Looks different from the other ones. That doesn't matter. I'll smash it and end everything. Capel. I'll do it. After all, that's why we're here. Stand back, everyone! Can't cut it! This time it's the other way around. What? All of the chains in the past were fastened to the surface. So the other way around means... This is the first chain going up to the moon. It can only be destroyed from the moon itself. Capel! Just calm down! can't destroy this, then everything we have done will be meaningless! I should have known it wouldn't work, but I wanted to try it at least once. Ed! Have you cooled off yet? Sorry. It's okay. Relax, Capel. We have come this far. There will be a way. Then let's start looking for one now. There's not much time left for us. All right. We all know that Lunaglyphs are given to Meigs by Aristos. What are you talking about? So, who do you think gave the first Aristo his Lunaglyph? Are you familiar with the rite of the Lunar Passage? Lunar Passage? Legend has it that the man who became the first Aristo created a passage to the moon. He used it to travel there and receive a lunaglyph from its god. But I don't see the connection. Well, who is to say that Leonid did not use this passage? Of course! So we go up to the moon and smash the chain. But how do we get up there? Although I know how to perform this rite, I cannot complete it alone. However... We are fortunate to have two other powerful Aristos here with us. And so, if we use that chain, we may succeed. As the protector of the Azure Land, I beseech you. As the protector of the Amberland, I beseech you. As the protector of the Alabaster Land, I beseech you. Moon of Power, the master of all Lunaglyphs, we humbly ask you to accept our prayers. I hope so. This rite is imperfect and time is precious. 
We cannot wait a moment longer. We must proceed at once. I take it we're walking up? I guess it's safe. Crimson One. I shall bestow upon you, the Crimson Sword, a mighty and noble blade. Though you are a child of an eclipse, and unless I shall grant you status and power as my embassy. Why do you hesitate? Remember all the injustices you faced. Do you not dream of a different world? Stand beside me. And the power is yours. The power to shape the world as you see fit. I trust you.
When you find what's important to you, fight for it with your life. I cannot. As an omniscient god, you must understand that I will not accept your blessing. If you grant me permission to defeat the Dread Knight and smash the Onyx Chain, then I have no need for any sort of reward. No. What? My loyal servant Leonid shall not come. To any harm. But why? The Onyx Chain is key to my plan and may not be severed. If it isn't, then the moon will crash into the world! Everything will be destroyed! This moon, the land, and all living creatures were forced upon me by her. None of this filth will be needed in the new world. Filth? We're all filth to you? Once I destroy the moon, the world, and everything on it, I shall create my utopia. This is the future of the human race. I don't understand. Why are you doing this? Understand? What is there to understand? All I seek is reverence and submission. Remember that you must serve your master. I won't! your side I won't let anyone hurt Capel You're no god I have no loyalty to you I serve Capel and no other Meet your end Looks like my days of being a priest are over I'm really going to enjoy tearing you into little tiny pieces <laughs> Gustav just said that he really hates you. I hate you too. You're horrible. Say your prayers, because you don't know who you're up against. This is for my brother. Prepare to die! The target is confirmed. What my darling is trying to say is that she won't forgive you. I shall deny you as well. Those with Lunaglyphs dare disobey me? We don't need Lunaglyphs. Right. We can live without glyphs. We're just fine without them. Pharos, the future that you've prepared for us, we don't want anything to do with it. Preposterous. We don't need... 
We can create a new world on our own! But even then, I trust in our strength. Repent. Compel. You lead them into darkness. Enjoy the helplessness of being unable to save those you hold dear. <laughs> 